Hi guys, this is Smart Physics tutorial for the um, spherical mirror. So we have um, a convex spherical mirror, and the object is here. So they want to know what is the y coordinate of the image. Okay. Um, so let's let's look at it conceptually. So, the object is here, and there is a convex mirror. So, where would the object um, would appear? It would appear on the other side. Okay, and in the mirror, like any mirror, the um, the op the image should be on the same side of the of the object because the mirror reflect their light okay if there was an object here it's gonna be reflected it's not gonna go into the other direction or to the other side okay so that's why the focal point for this this convex mirror is negative okay so So to find the focal point, it's r over two. Okay, it's r over two. Now for me, it was forty-five divided by two, which is equal to twenty-two point five. Okay, centimeters. Okay. So let's find the the s prime. I'll call this D also as S. Okay, so one over F will be equal to one over S. This is the distance between the object and the mirror. Plus one over S prime. S prime is the distance between the the mirror and the image. Okay. All right. So the focal point is one over minus 22.5 and I just told you why it's negative the focal point because the focal point is in the the opposite of where should the focal point be um, for the converge the other one the other mirror when there's an object here and then the light come like this any parallel light will, will come to the focal point okay so this focal point is positive because this what should happen to the to the light when it encounters a mirror okay so equal 1 over s 1 over s is 1 over 18 plus 1 over s prime okay so s prime will be equal to um, minus 1 over 22.5 Minus one over eighteen. So let's plug in that. So uh, minus twenty-two point five uh, plus minus eighteen power and the answer. I'm being cool here. Okay, so it's, so it's equal to minus 10. Okay. So what does minus 10 mean? What does this minus mean? Um, it means that the... Oops, what does this minus mean? It means that the object is on the other side of what it's supposed to be. Okay. So this mirror, when the object will... like. Where, where the image will be, it will be like somewhere down here. Depends on the position of this guy here. Okay. So the image here will be positive. Because it's on the right side. But here it's negative, so it's produced on the opposite side of where it should be for a mirror. Okay. So that's what the negative is saying here. Alright, cool. So...
let's get the magnification just an extra thing like to understand the problem magnification will be s prime divided by s which is s prime is minus 10 divided by 18 okay and there's a minus sign here too so it's minus minus so we'll get a positive number so divided by 18 you'll get minus 555 that's positive so point five 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 okay what does this tells us this tells us that the the image will be will be um, will be upright upright oh it will be like the same the same um, the same shape like it's not flipped or anything for this guy okay so the image when I did this you know how to draw this you get like a line that it's gonna be perpendicular to the surface here and it's gonna get reflected so you'll get um, you'll give it um, you'll extend it by putting dots here and then one is parallel and the reflection is the same as the one that goes to the focal point okay so I got an object the image I got it was here and it does make sense it's not very accurate but when you look at the magnification it's almost half which should be like a little bit more here okay so let, let's get the um, let's get the height so h prime divided by h will be equal to minus s prime divided by s alright so h prime is um, the one we want to find times h h was minus 7 and the s prime was minus 10 divided by s which was 18 and there is a minus here so you can see that the answer should be negative because negative negative is going to be positive and the negative here so it's 70 divided by 18 okay 70 divided by 18 which is 3.88 negative negative okay and it's negative because you can see here if the, we said that this is the um, y positive uh, this is here going to be the y negative so you can see that the it's on the y negative and it's less than the one before the object Okay, I hope this makes sense. Good luck, guys.